Hi guys, I'm Jess and in this post I'm going to be looking at the Suffolk Free Press front cover. So the masthead of this paper doesn't stand out a lot because of the colours. The title Suffolk has been shown in a small font so it means it doesn't stand out to audiences a considerable amount. But the words Free Press have been shown in a much bigger blue font which makes them stand out a lot more. Meaning that they can see them words from a long distance but the word Suffolk they may not be able to see from such... A distance away so in the skyline there's a date and the website address and other information that audiences need to know about the newspaper it's been shown in quite a small font so it doesn't stand out to audiences from a long distance away but they'll be able to read it when they pick up the newspaper this information is key to the audiences when they're buying the newspaper as it shows things like the date of when it was released the price of the newspaper the website address and social media links on the cover there are two competitions shown at the top of the page. This has been used to attract audiences attention more to the cover as it gives them a chance to win some things from the newspaper. They have been shown in two bright blue cell blocks making them easy for audience to see and they are very eye catching to them. The audiences will then be aware of the competitions because they are shown in such bright colours and they will be able to see them easily. And because of the colours, they'll be one of the most eye-catching features on the front cover of the paper. Instead of be local business adverts being shown, these competitions have been shown to make it seem more eye-catching to the audiences and give them more incentive to buy the newspaper instead of buying another one. So, the newspaper is breaking the conventions of a local newspaper as there's only one main story shown on the front cover instead of lots of little feature stories and one main headline. Most other local newspapers have feature stories to attract their audiences, but as there's not many feature stories, it's suggesting that there's not very much in the newspaper for audiences to read, and it will attract audiences as they'll want to find out more information about the only story that's been shown, because it's implying that there's a lot of information to be known about this story and that is a very big story that's happening in the area. As there's only that story shown there's more information underneath the title which there might not have been in other papers that have feature stories because they're taking up the space and there's also information given with the picture so this tells audiences who the story is about and what else may have been happened or where it would have happened. Okay guys thanks for watching!